All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. It is time for the trials by fire. Now, one does not simply walk into the kitchen and eat ghost peppers. So, what we're gonna do today is we're gonna test some super spicy items. This should be uh, something pretty interesting. Watch my reactions. Do I like them? Do I not like them? Now, I do like some spicy things, but overall, I generally prefer the flavor of spice as opposed to the level of spice. So what we have today are blue diamond almonds, and we're gonna warm up here a little bit. <laughs> Figuratively, of course, with some habanero flavored almonds. Now, habaneros are pretty spicy, or habanero, however you wanna pronounce it. Take a look at those. Try it, let's try one. Hmm. It's got a really good flavor to it. I wouldn't say it's super spicy. You're gonna have another one. I'll do three. The power of three. Good. Um, I haven't eaten a lot of raw habaneros to know like if this is an accurate flavor or not. Usually you just get the burn or like we'll cut it out, take the seeds out if we're making salsas or um, if you've checked out our sofrito video, spicy stuff. But uh, I like this. This is not something I guess the package does say bold. It says it's, uh, you know, on the package, it says season with bold, spicy, bold flavors. So satisfying, you can't put them down. That I could agree with. I really feel like I want to keep eating these. And it says combining the spicy taste of habanero chili pepper with the smoky flavor of barbecue. I would say that these are more on the barbecue side than, than the spicy chili pepper side, but it is very, very good. I really like these. From the almond people. Blue diamond. So on the spicy side, or the spicy scale, the Scoville units, habaneros, 100,000 to like 350, depending on how it's grown, more heat and stuff can make it more spicy or more, uh, the flavor more pronounced. Get that burn, baby burn. Ghost peppers, you know, those could be anywhere from like 850,000 to over a million. So it's a large spice multiplier. And it's time to get Fired up. So what do I have here? Blue Diamond Extreme Ghost Pepper. I think they also have a Carolina Reaper one, but I wasn't able to find that. Open it up, it's still sealed. I haven't tried these yet, so I wanted to get a, a true reaction real time with all of you. So it's very interesting. Like this habanero, it smells like an almond, like a barbecue almond. This definitely smells different. I don't want to get too close. Again, I don't want to inhale this and like burn up my nose or anything or my eyes. This has a smell like it's spicy. Let's try one. We're going to try one. This is definitely more spicy than the habanero. That is for sure. I'm gonna wait a second before I keep throwing them in there. Right, things are just super spicy. If you like spicy, you know, like once you start eating them, you have to keep eating them. Then when you stop, you pay the price. So here I'm waiting to see like, what level is this really? I feel a little bit of spice in the back, not overbearing. I'm actually tasting the ghost pepper <coughs> and coughing, choking, it's slowly building. I'm gonna have one more against my better judgment. Mm. They're very heavily, uh, very heavily spiced. Yeah, it's starting to heat up now a little bit. This is appropriate. I mean, ghost peppers can be um, frightening, right? In incorrectly used, these could do some pretty serious damage to you. Um, we know some other channels who've tried super spicy stuff and the sweats or stomach hurts they throw up, you know, all sorts of stuff. So these are actually really good. I like the spice level. It's just enough and it's continuing and lingering. So it's not killing me yet, but uh, I guess what we could do is throw a few more in. Hmm. <laughs> Now, there we go. Now it's building. You know, and the salt helps cut it a little bit. 
And I have a glass of water, which I am now going to use. Just to keep myself from coughing. Good stuff, highly recommend. If you like spicy, go directly to ghost pepper. If you like flavor, start with the habanero or mix them both. You know, make it a, uh, a mixed bag. <laughs> they should actually sell those. You know, maybe like one, uh, one Carolina Reaper for every 25 ghost pepper for every 100 habanero. Just make it a combo. Make it a uh, almond blend. I'm not sorry I did it and I'll do it again. And as a matter of fact, uh, make sure you comment below, share this video, give us the thumbs up. There's a thumbs up for eating spicy stuff on camera. It's not a, <laughs> it's not every day that we do this. I'm definitely gonna continue eating these. It's addictive. It'll be the last almond, one almond too many before the fire sale. So uh, we'll see you next week. It's some really great stuff coming up. And uh, I'm gonna refill my water cup and tamp down this burn. But I can't stop eating them. Hmm. And that is your buzz with your cuz. Your news break.